Hi, I'm Pete Forsyth, and today I'm going to show you how to create a Wikipedia user page. This is part of a series of instructional videos about Wikipedia produced for the Communicate OER project. As you know, Wikipedia is a project where tens of thousands of volunteers around the world come together to produce an encyclopedia. Of course, communication is an important part of that process, and one of the important pieces of how we communicate is understanding who each other are. Every Wikipedia page has a talk page associated with it. As you can see in the upper left corner, there's a talk button on nearly every Wikipedia page. If we click that, we're going to see that there's some discussion. Each section is a different topic, and you see people talking back and forth. In this case, everyone involved in the discussions has a user page, and we can tell because the, uh, the links to their names are blue. Uh, most links will be either blue or red. If they're red, that's going to indicate that there is no user page. So let's go to a different page where we can see an example of this. This is the team page for the Communicate OER project, and lots of people have come here to introduce themselves. You see many blue links, and then you see a few red links as we go further down. The blue links all indicate that people have a user page, and I'm going to just click on a few of them so that we can get an idea of how people present themselves. Here's one where someone gives a pretty straightforward introduction, writes several paragraphs about his work. Here's one which is going to demonstrate a common phenomenon on Wikipedia, where people don't describe themselves so much in words, but they do use these user boxes that describe things about their interests or about their personal lives. And here's another example of a more elaborate user page that contains both text and images. But if we click on one of the links that's red, we're going to see that there is no user page. It tells us Wikipedia does not have a user page with this exact title, and it actually gives us an opportunity to create the user page even though we are not this person. Well, we don't want to do that, but if you have created a, user, a Wikipedia user account and you haven't yet made a user page, you'll see that your own username at the top of the screen is red. Mine here is blue, but that's because I've already created a page. I'm going to click it, and if you had not created a page, you would see a big blank screen like this. So for the purposes of getting started on Wikipedia, you don't need to do anything fancy, but it is a good idea to tell uh, to put a little bit of information here to let other Wikipedians know who you are and what you're doing on Wikipedia. I would suggest that you use just two or three sentences, give your name if you like, or just your username if you prefer to remain anonymous. Just type something in plain text into the edit window. Um, you might want to say where you work, what your interests are on Wikipedia, what article you want to work on, or you might just say that you're taking uh, the School of Open uh, writing Wikipedia articles class. It's really up to you. You can share as much or as little as you like, but it's a good idea to share something. You would type that into this page and then scroll down. I always recommend using an edit summary. In this case, you might just say something simple like create user page, and then you would click save page. That's all you have to do, and now you have a Wikipedia user page and you can get to the more fun parts of editing Wikipedia. This video was produced as part of the Communicate OER project in 2013. Communicate OER is a project to foster collaboration in improving Wikipedia articles about openness and education. For more instructional vi videos about Wikipedia, visit our project's home. If you'd like to take a free online course about Wikipedia, visit us at the School of Open. Thanks for watching.